guys. I'm here with Dow from Garmin. Garmin, everyone knows the name, really big player in the market. Dow's going to go over not entirely the whole Garmin line because I think you guys know probably some of that stuff, but he's going to go over some uh, cool things that I wasn't even aware of. Dow, take it away and tell us what you got. Yeah, so I'm going to show you the new GPS. This is our new 15 uh, watt, ultra wide screen. So it's a full functioning MFD. It's got your uh, uh, chart plotter, radar, sonar, everything's built in. Uh, but we also have a feature uh, in here, in all of our GPS map series, where we have an SOS icon. So if you click on that SOS icon, let's say somebody's on your boat, you know, you're bringing friends on your boat, maybe they're not familiar with your electronics, something happens to the captain, hopefully not. Uh, I always tell them, hey, if anything happens to me, please hit that SOS key, then follow the instructions. What's happening? Maybe I've got a grounding, okay? Here, you're going to get a pop-up, DSC call disabled, set VHF radio, click on your radio and send a call. So grab your VHF radio, DSC will be sent. And then here's your instructions on what to say when you grab that VHF radio. Mayday, 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 here's my boat name, here's the latitude and longitude, those are the coordinates where that boat is. So again, it's just a huge uh, uh, safety uh this is just a no-brainer. And, a and no -brainer, the thing is, really. even people that know what they're yeah. supposed to yeah. do during a time of emergency, yeah. they freak out, I don't know what to do. Yeah, the, you know, I don't know, I'm exactly. in a weird situation. If they remember one thing, hit SOS, hit SOS. follow the instructions. And like yeah. you said, latitude and longitude, I don't know where to go to find that. Well, yeah. guess what? Yeah. They put it yeah. right there for you. Yeah. This is really slick. And you told me a second ago, this is on every GPS map that Series Garmin makes. So all the way back to the ones that were a few years ago, Correct. that feature is going to be on your Correct. GPS map. Correct. That is a really, really valuable deal. Correct. Super cool. Yep. I always get that call. People go, should I have a v should I take my cell phone, not a VHF? I'm going, who are you going to call? Am I going to call my wife, tell her I'm sinking? That's or right. am I going to call Coast Guard? That's going to help you. Yeah, and it directly tells you how to do it. You don't have yep. to feel radio anxiety. Exactly. Just read what it says on exactly. the screen. Really cool. Tell us about this big yeah. boy here. So this is our 27-inch screen. Um, it's the largest screen on the market. It's 4K. But what you're seeing here is what we call surround view. So this is a series of six cameras that this is usually installed at the factory when the boat's being built. So once these cameras are on the boat, we align them, uh, calibrate them, and you're going to get this type of view when you're backing. It definitely helps when you're backing the boat or coming into a dock. And then you could put guard zones around or, or zones uh, that tell you how far you, you're coming uh, before you run, a run into the dock. So, so this is like a 360 camera Correct. for your boat Correct. that gives you a lot of information. Um, obviously, you know, there's no substitute for line of sight, Correct. but on big boats and, and boats like this, where you have obstruction of view or inclement weather. You've got a lot of information here with a lot of cameras. That's super cool stuff. Yep, yep. All right, Dow, um, what do we have over here? We got inReach, is that what you said? Yep, so uh, a lot of people don't know about inReach. inReach, uh, uh, we, we, we bought this company a few years ago and now we're incorporated into almost all of our handhelds. So this will give you two-way texting anywhere in the world. So, uh, you know, you're on the boat, you know, uh, you're out 20 miles, you don't have cell phone coverage, you can you can do two-way texting, I can text my wife, tell her, hey, I'm catching fish, I'm gonna be home late. The other thing you can do, you can hit the SOS, and within two minutes, you're gonna get a message back. What's, what's your emergency? You can text back, boat's in the, boat sinking. Uh, the, 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 it, it's just like having an alarm system for your house. It's, it's monitored 24 seven, you're gonna get that instant text back, helicopters on the way you know, ETA 10 minutes, you know? So that's that's peace of mind. So when right? we send that distress call, it does goes, it know where you are? It, when you, Every time you send this distress call, it sends your latitude and longitude. Wow. If I send that to my wife, she can pull up on the map and it'll actually pinpoint where I am on the map. So a lot of people who are cruising, they may set that to send a, send a link, you know, every 30 minutes, every hour. And when I get that, I go, okay, they're going across to the Bahamas, they're there. So uh, kind of peace of mind on the water. And again, this works anywhere in the world. Monthly wow. subscription. Right? Monthly subscription is with the industry. Nice little thing though. And does Correct. it do, I, I see, how do we interface on that? Do so, we talk to it or? You, no, on this one, you can do your, you can interface uh, and do all your inputs straight through the screen. A little difficult. Yeah. With the GPS map series, you can hook it up and do all your text and do everything through the chart plotter. Nice. Makes it much easier. Okay, but but I mean, for distress, the main thing is, guys, if you're out there, you're having struggle, don't call your wife, number one. No. She's not gonna be able to help you. But this automatically sends your latitude yeah. and longitude, and that's the first thing anyone's gonna ask you is where are you yeah. and what's going on. And remember, I keep this on my backpack. When I'm hiking, hunting, riding on my motorcycle, yeah. 
I have an in-reach on me. I broke my collarbone riding a motorcycle. I was five miles from the nearest person. I hit the in-reach, hit the SOS, broken collarbone, paramedics came to the dirt road, I walked out to it. So, nice. Uh, it, it, it is a lifesaver. That's cool. Now let's go check out this thing over here. There's yeah. a lot of technology yeah. going on over here. All right, let's talk about technology. We talk about safety a lot, and there's safety in a lot of these things, but this thing looks like uh, if I was going to put technology in a picture, yep. this is it. Tell us what's going on there, Yeah, Dal. this is loaded to the gill. So of course, it has our chart plotters on it, so that's our widescreen our 15X3 widescreen. This is our new Echomap 16 Ultra. Um, and, you know, of course, it's loaded with the Fusion stereo, uh, a sub in the back, uh, the Fusion uh, head unit. But the big thing here is uh, at iCast, a few months ago, we released a Garmin current trolling motor. So this trolling motor is 12 or 24 volts. At 12 uh, volts, it's uh, it's 30 pounds of thrust at 24. It is 50 pounds of thrust. So it has wireless foot pedals, which is pretty unique. So these are your wireless foot pedals. So this steers just like a zero turn mower. So forward, you push them forward, down, the motor goes in reverse. You do one left, one down, one forward, one down will go left, the other way will go right. Wow. So we also incorporated these little toggles right here, so I can pre-program. If I'm kayaking and I want to mark a waypoint, I can say, okay, I want, I want the right pedal. When I do that, it'll mark a waypoint. So, uh, so many different ways you can uh, configure the boat. Wow. Of course, we had to add live scope. Uh, yeah. So this has a uh, remote control here for your live scope, so you'll be able to do that forward-facing sonar. Very but cool. Basically, everything Garmin makes is uh, on this kayak. Man, this is really, really a pretty yeah. tricked out pretty deal. Pretty tricked out. So yeah. we've got everything all the information going what what about um this this motor obviously probably pretty efficient how long will it run on that uh you could do you know again it depends on your batteries and depends on what your power rating is uh so you're looking at about you know you could probably get seven to eight hours out of the battery you know the other thing that comes with this unit talking about safety we have an mob system so if you go off the boat it'll kill the motor so nice. this is a so it's not going to run away from it. correct so uh uh, yeah, it's pretty much loaded to the gills. Really uh, a slick deal. Slick Are deal. the batteries already in this unit, or no, where would they go? No, it runs on normal lead acid or lithium ion batteries. So right here, the batteries would go right Okay, here. so we could do lithium in here you and have plenty of You could put a 12-volt lithium battery in here, 30 pounds of thrust, run probably all day long. Very nice. This is technology, guys. Garmin's got it. They've got technology, a lot of safety stuff. And uh, he tells me there's some new stuff coming out soon. Stay tuned, we'll show you guys that when it comes out. Hey guys, thanks for watching our IBEX content. Hey, if you or someone you know hasn't already been approached by SafeWake that does boating safety and technology, please drop us a line below. At SafeWake, we are committed to bringing the latest and greatest boating safety and technology to our audience. Thanks guys.